Hi everyone. Today I'm going to show you how to create a symmetrical fish bowl for your Henri Matisse collage. Symmetrical means that it is going to be even and lined up the same on both sides. Okay, what you're going to do first, you're going to pick a large piece of paper that Mr. Cummings will give you. Um, my favorite color is purple, so I pick purple. And I'm going to write my name on the back, a little bit hard to see with the pencil. And I'm going to make sure that I hold my paper vertically or portrait style. Don't hold it this way. Hold it this way. Then everybody's going to get a white piece of paper. What I want you to do with the white piece of paper is fold it in half once, bringing one side to the other, make a crease on your desk, and you're going to notice this side is the part that doesn't open. This side does open. So make sure that the part that doesn't open is over here on the left. What I'm going to do is I'm going to make half of a fishbowl. I'm going to make the top part of the fishbowl. Here's the neck. And here's the big half circle. The fish is going to go in here. But did I make a whole fishbowl or half of a fishbowl? You're right, half. Now I'm going to cut that half out. I'm going to make sure I don't cut anything over here. All right, because if I cut anything over there, I'm going to have two pieces rather than one. I'm just going to cut right on the pencil line that I made. That's all I have to do. Now, I'm going to get rid of this paper. And when I open it up, <gasps> awesome. I have a full fishbowl. And it's symmetrical, which means it's even on both sides. And I'll show you when I glue it down what I mean by that. I'm going to glue this right in the middle of my paper. Okay. So notice everything that's on this side is lined up the same on the other. Okay. The next thing I can do is I can start choosing some colored papers that I can use, even if they're cut up, to make maybe a table for my fish bowl. So I'm going to make almost a rectangle shape here. This could make it look like there's a tablecloth underneath the fishbowl. So we have this. Looking good. It's going to take a little bit off of the top here. And then I'm going to glue this on. And look, that looks like a tablecloth. Now I'm going to show you another one. Another one that I made earlier shows a stool. And then the fishbowl is on the stool. What I also started to, doing, to do is I also started to uh, create shapes. I'm using my imagination and making up really cool shapes. I had already glued these on. Maybe I'll make another shape over here. Maybe I'll do this, which is similar to this, but a little bit different. And I'm going to cut this out. So you can use spirals. You can do triangles. You can do diamonds. You can do circles. And I'm going to make that wallpaper that Henri Matisse liked to put in his pictures with bright colors. So I'm repeating shapes and lines and I'm doing curves and I'm just having fun making these with cut paper. And then every time I make a shape, I'm going to glue it down so I don't lose the shape that I made. So look, here's my glue stick. And I'm going to glue it this way. And look at that. Look at how nice. I can put another shape maybe going and going here and overlapping. So have fun. Make some interesting shapes. And I can't wait to see your fishbowl. Enjoy.